Hey guys, what's up? So on the next update, jungle items will be removed and their effects will be placed on boots. Aside from that, there will be many changes on the way it works. To give you a better idea of the changes, here are the old jungle effects. And here is what happened with the new update. The first and most significant change is the removal of increased damage on jungle creeps. They replaced it with continuous true damage over 3 seconds. Here is an example. The damage of advanced server is lower, but it has this true damage. The true damage scales with the hero's level and can reach up to 375. Next is the higher resource reduction when a jungler tries to occupy a lane. From 50, it's now 70% less gold than experience. Here is an example. As you can see, the gold and experience are lower on advanced server. So for junglers, try to stay away from the lanes in the first 5 minutes. And for non-junglers, please don't steal the jungle creeps from your jungler. Next is the removal of plus 30 gold when a jungler gets a kill or assist. As you can see, there's no plus 30 gold on advanced server. Next is the stacks. Previously, you could only gain jungle stacks from killing a jungle creep. Now you can earn stacks from kills and assists. Next are the stats you get from each stat. Previously, you get either physical attack, defense stat, or damage increase from each jungle stat. In the new update, you won't get anything until you reach 15 stacks. And once you reach full stacks, you will only get plus 15 physical attack and plus 15 magic power. Next is the bonus resources from killing jungle creeps. They've increased it to 60% experience and gold. So for the big question, is this a nerf for junglers? Yes, but actually no. If we compare the damage of a full stack jungler on both versions, we can see that the old one has higher damage. But this is an invalid comparison because we didn't take into account the cost of the jungle item. In the new patch, jungle item is actually free. All you need to do is buy boots and all of your jungle effects will take effect. In the old patch, you have to spend 1,600 to 1,800 gold depending on the jungle item. With the new patch, you can immediately use that gold for your core item instead of waiting for your level 3 jungle. So who can benefit this? First hero I could think of is Jungle Claude. He can rush his Demon Hunter sword after buying boots. Fanny can start building Bloodlust Axe right after boots. Harley can start with Arcane Boots for that early negative armor effect. Who else do you think will have an advantage with the new jungle effects? So in the new update, there will be 3 new retribution skills. You can activate this once you've collected 5 jungle stacks. First skill is called Bloody Retribution and it will heal the jungler while deal damage on the enemy hero over 3 seconds. Damage is equivalent to the caster's 12% max HP. Second skill is Ice Retribution. It can absorb the movement speed of the enemy and be transferred to the caster. So it makes you faster and the enemy slower for 3 seconds. Last skill is called Flame Retribution. It lets you absorb the target's physical and magic power for 3 seconds. You can select which skill to use at the start of the game. Just go to the jungle tab and select the skill you like. It will make you buy the boots with the skill you chose. If you made a mistake, you can sell the boots and then choose a different skill. By the way, they already fixed the mana problem for junglers. It now gives decent mana regeneration after killing a jungle creep. So no worries for those skill-based junglers. 
So what can you say about the new jungle items? Who do you think can benefit from the new effects? Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. That's all for this video. Stay safe and thank you for watching.